Hey, Alan here, and uh, I just want to take a few minutes out of your day. Uh, this is something that I've been meaning to get done, and I just think is so cool. You know, Send Out Cards has undergone so many updates and upgrades that I finally decided this morning to sit down and break through the technical barrier to creating a really cool Picture Plus card, and I want to actually demonstrate that process for you. So let me start here. I'm actually logged into my account. I'm at SendOutCards.com. And over here on the right hand side where it says account, I'm logged in, you can see that. And uh, now, if I click on pictures, there are two things I want you to be aware of, or two or three things. First of all, this is where your picture gallery is, and you can manage it, you can get rid of pictures you don't need, you can add pictures. Here's where we upload pictures, and, and when we say upload, it means taking them from your computer and sending them over to send out cards. So I'm going to click on this, and I want you to see two things here. You can click Browse Photos, or you can also add a YouTube URL. That means a YouTube website address. So if you've made a video, and you want that video embedded in your card as a QR code, and I'll show you that in a minute, then all you need to do is upload the video to YouTube, grab the website address, and copy and paste it right here. So that'll get you a QR code. Now, right here, if you click Browse Photos, it brings you into Windows Explorer, and using Windows Explorer, you can go in and you can, you can select photos and things like that that you want. So that's, that's all you really need to know from this particular part of what's going on. Let me close out this window, and let's go to Cards, Create a Card. Now the fun begins. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a Picture Plus card doesn't matter when you got involved in Send Out Cards, and if you're not involved, you certainly want to be and you certainly want to get in touch with me, and uh, that can be through experiencethepeak.com, and uh, certainly feel free to reach out to me. When you go to Create a Picture Plus Card, you're given the option for uh, any of these layouts, big cards, vertical templates, or horizontal templates. I'm going to pick a three-panel card, and I'm going to pick one that's horizontally oriented. So with that choice, now we see what we get. It's going to be a blank card. That's what Picture Plus is all about. You are customizing it, whether it's for your personal purposes or whether it's for a business, you're customizing it. And remember, these are real cards. When you're done with this process, you're going to be able to save this card. It's a card that you're going to be able to use over and over again. You can even modify it with new messages. And you're going to be able to, when you click Send, have it printed by the company, that's what they do, and then mailed out. It can even be put into as a part of a campaign. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go to Pictures, and this is the cover of the card. I can tell that because I'm looking here at that element. This is the cover, and I'm kind of partial to this. It's a Hubble Space Telescope image that I downloaded from the web, and now I'm transferring over to send out cards already done. So when I do that, that's going to be the cover of my card. And let's say I want to put some text there. I can add a blank text item. I can, let's say, pick out yellow might be good here. And I want a good bold font. And I could say, welcome to the future. Now, I want to play around with that a little bit. I'm going to uh, modify the shape of the window. And I also want to, I'm going to do Control A, Mac Command A, and I'm going to make the text larger. Let's make it a 25. I'm going to have to drag it out a little bit. And if I raise it up, then I click off it, and you can see what we've got. And if I want to make it a little bit better, I could click back in there. I could click back in there. There we go. And. I can move it around a little bit, get it off of that uh, pulsar or quasar or whatever that thing is. Too bright. All right. So that's, that's my cover. Short, sweet, and simple. Now, what I've got here are three panels. These three panels is what are going to become the majority of my card. All right? So what do I want to do? I'm going to take one of the beach scenes. I'm here in Florida. Let's, let's use a beach scene. And I'll grab this one. And I want to click Span. And what does that do? It immediately makes it appear over all three panels. Notice the lower panel here is the volleyball court. Move this out of the way slightly so I can navigate. The middle is the water 
and, and the uh, sky, and the upper part is just sky. Pretty cool, right? Okay, so let's say now I want to insert myself into the image, and I'm going to bring my image over here, drag it over, click and drag, and I'll be next to this person walking on the beach, and I'll make myself a little bit smaller, and right next to the water. Not quite in the water, but right next to the water. All right? And see here it says click to type your message. What I can do is rearrange this text again. I can move it over here, uh, maybe move the whole thing up somewhat, and type in, what's he doing here? And have an arrow over to myself. Now, that text is probably a little bit too big for where we are right now. So let's make it a 20. And uh, actually, I want to move myself over. I want to make this a little bit wider. And we'll let it go with that. Pretty cool, huh? Now, uh, because I'm a little silly and it's getting late in the day, uh, we're going to put a flower right on the volleyball court. One of my clients in uh, business with me is a florist, does a great job. Ask me who it is, they're down in the West Palm area. And we're going to put one of his floral arrangements here. And we might as well take the other one and put it over here. And we'll shrink them down in size. And in fact, what I'd like to do is make it a little bit more decorative. I'm not the most uh, creative guy on the planet. So we're going to tilt them a little bit. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty cool. All right, now, so let's go up to the upper part of the card. And we'll go up to the top. And we'll add a couple more images. The Florida sky can always be kind of neat. So I want to grab these images of the Florida sky. And again, we'll make that a little smaller. We'll grab this one. And we'll make that a little smaller. And of course, we could do something creative with here. And I'll type out a message here. The Florida sky is so dynamic at times. Now, I don't like the font for this, and I don't like the color. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change it to a, uh, oh, how about just black? And um, we're going to make it slightly smaller. And we'll put in the rascal. Pretty cool, huh? All right. Now, what I also want to do is imagine um, I'm sending them a video. Well, what am I going to do? This happens to be a video introducing me. So I'll drag it over, and I can simply put in some instructions. I can add a blank text item. Actually, I'll just click here where it says click to type message. And I'll say, um, use a QR uh, reader on your smartphone, or go to the URL provided. That's the website address. And I'm going to, again, it's Control A. It's just like in Microsoft Word. I'll put that into my own handwriting, my own personal font. And uh, we'll see if I can make it a nice dark blue. We'll go to more colors. How about this blue right here? Maybe even make it a little darker. And click OK. And there we are. And as a matter of fact, I want to break the line and move the whole thing up here. So you've got my message there. Real simple, short, sweet message. And that, my friend, is pretty much how you make a Picture Plus card. I'm going to save it. 
that's going to make it available in my catalog so that when I go to my card catalog and I go searching for cards then I'm going to be able to find that and it's going to be just one of the offerings that I can make to people okay so uh, this again is Alan Sills if you uh, are with me and send out cards great uh, I hope this has been helpful. If you're not yet with me and send out cards, by all means, experiencethepeak.com. Uh, catch up with me, and I'd love to get to know you better. And if there's good synergy or if you just want an account, well, now you got an idea of what it can do. You can even include gifts with these cards. It is so simple. And again, the company prints the cards from Utah and from, uh, from Australia, and uh, that's how we get them out.